One of the most consistent archetypes throughout the popper format is the Boros mid-range strategy, and it's slightly evolved over time, but it's still kind of the same shell. These days, it's the, called Boros Synthesizer, just kind of playing cards like Glint Hawk and uh, Core Skyfisher to bounce artifacts, bounce threats, and just stay aggressive. So this version is kind of a little bit more aggressive, but you do have the artifact heavy ones where you're just kind of drawing and dinking your opponent in the air. So specifically in this matchup, we come up against the Batterfist build where you may not be bouncing artifacts to draw cards but you're bouncing the batter fist to recur your threats i uh, you kind of have more threats in your opponent hit them with a bunch of galbas and lightning bolts it's like that really wants to slow things down and play to their pace and i'm fine with that i can slow things down i can play slow but as an affinity player i can also turn the temple back enjoy Upper mill on the draw we are not uh this isn't this isn't a great hand yeah, especially if it's going to be some type of red variant. Um, let me think here. So if it's burn, if it, okay, if it's burned, the Car Clan Shaman plus the Reckoner's Bargain is actually pretty sweet because if we can get out Mer Enforcer, yeah, if I can get out Mer Enforcer, which I'm going to try and prioritize here, then I can Reckoner's Bargain it for seven life and the Kark Clan Shaman can deal with any goblins that come down. Oh, okay. Mm, okay, this is going to be a little bit grindy then. All right. Fair enough. A little slow off the start, but that's fine. All right, we can play the Frog Might from there and then just pass through. Got our fourth artifact. Next turn, we can... Uh, like we can play Mer Enforcer, but is that what I want to do? Potentially. Might just want to just get out my board. For Mirrodin. Okay. Let's do this. Let's go to attack. Yeah, like they're gonna they're gonna keep bouncing um they're gonna keep bouncing this right just to create some value which is fine and i'll just i'll just counter i'll just counter those creatures that's the plan i will just counter those creatures i will rebuke this So I don't want them to get going because also the fact that Car Clan Shaman can't kill that, right? So there's that as well. Um, so I do want to be cognizant of that. Car Clan Shaman cannot kill that. But what I can do now is, uh, well, I want to attack in first. Yeah. So let's let's go in for combat. Attack. You can kill my burn force. So that's fine. Cause then like my, my whole thing is accomplished here. Yeah. That's fine. I don't mind. Their board is clear. Um, I'm going to play the Nihil spell bomb and then pass through. I can deadly dispute if I needed to, I can deadly dispute the blood token. That's probably what I want to do. Oh, interesting. Okay. All right. Cool. I'm down for it. All right. Okay. Let that one resolve. And do I want to Reckoner's Bargain this? I think I want to Reckoner's this and just gain the life off of it. Yeah. I think I just want to Reckoner's this. And, and I'll save the deadly dispute stuff for when I need to like really like draw through hard. But I'll get the value I want out of it. Like they played Car Clan Shaman. Uh, the, the problem with this card in the mirror, in the mirror, uh, in this matchup right now is again it just doesn't kill the Glint Hawks or the uh, the two three that I'm forgetting the name of right now. Okay, all these deadly disputes.
I mean, I'll just play him again. Honestly, I'll just play him again. Need one? All right, bet. Frog might. We're enforcer. I'll just, I'll, I'll just run it back. I'll just run it back. You spent, you spent all that effort just to, just to do that. We'll, we'll keep you on the back burner, I guess. <clears throat> but definitely a matchup where we're gonna want the gorilla shamans. They're gonna bring the gorilla shamans in against us, and and we're gonna want it against them as well. All right, I love this. I love this. Yeah, equip, equip it onto that. Equip it onto that if you want. I'll attack him with my frog might. I, I have no, I have no qualms. But easy. Let's attack. <laughs> the blood fountain again is actually hilarious. <laughs> they they use up a gal blast just to kill my Mer Enforcer. I love it. I actually love it. <clears throat> yep. I'll play the Blood Fountain. Blood Fountain's. The, I feel like the, this card is definitely going to be one of those like how we beat the mirror. How we beat. I keep calling this the mirror. How we beat this matchup type of thing right now. So we're just going to bring our creatures back. Yep, and they're, they're just drawn through. They're just drawn through. Yep. Synthesizer. Gal blast. Hit me in the face. Hit me in the face. I did leave my creatures open, so it's not like I'm deadly disputing anything. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Hit me for, hit me for four. You might as well. Yep, going for the... Going for the attack. Going for the attack. Good for you. That's fine. Let that through. Let that through. You're gonna play a two three. No, no two three. Interesting. I uh, tapped this the wrong way. I, I feel like I should just get my nail spell bomb value here, honestly. But like, as in, I should have if I didn't tap the black. Um, that's fine. So I got, I, I I got plenty of black here. So let's make that work. Begin combat attack. Like once I start drawing Gal Blast, like they ain't got counter spells. Once I start drawing Gal Blast, it's about to it's about to pop off. It's about to pop off. Don't worry. It's about to pop off once I start drawing that stuff. All right. What do you got for three? Huh? What do you? Oh, interesting. Actually, oh, okay. All right, that's interesting. I didn't. I didn't think that would be a spell that they played. That is interesting. <clears throat> so they'll draw a card. That's fine. They're essentially like they're trying to find things right now, but okay, Foundry Helix is not a okay. I'll tell you what, this was not a card that uh, I was familiar with at all. I did not think that this deck would be playing that. Okay, I'm I'm just gonna blow this up with. I don't know why you do that. I'm just gonna blow this up. Okay, you do your thing. You play the Glen Hawk. Glen Hawk's kind of sad here. <clears throat> right uh i will wipe the board here that's the logical thing to do nice oh my god and i can hit the glen hawk too holy let's go this is huge the metallic rebuke is actually huge here holy they don't get to reset their barbed okay um or I just, I, uh, do I let them? I was like, I feel like I kind of just, do I counter the barbs or do I let this resolve? I think I counter the barb. I think I counter this. Okay, so let's just do this. Uh, I mean, this is going to die anyway. 
there's probably a more efficient way that I can do this, but yeah. That way I kill the, um, yeah, I kill the, the two, two with vigilance as well. Metallic rebuke. Pay one. Yep. That way they're doing nothing. Perfect. I'm just back on my turn. <laughs> Could I play Great Furnace? Could I play Blood Fountain? <laughs> play the Marine, get the Morn Forces back. Let's go. Let's get it. <laughs> play them out. Play the Marine Forcer. Okay. All right. <laughs> Yo, good vibes. Good vibes only. Good vibes only. All right. I'll get my value out of this. Go to attacks. Nothing. Uh. I'll play out a. I'll play out a ginger brute. I'll play out a ginger brute. I'm not like like fiending to like uh i'm not fiending to gal blast them or anything right now but i actually kind of want to save the gal blast for like they used one gal blast on a creature they use one another gal blast on a creature here actually so i'm never getting whatever they hit with this i'm never getting it back based on my current yeah one gal blast hit me too yeah so i'm never getting whatever creature they uh thing here so i might as well just deadly dispute it so that if i draw another thing here i just sack this there you go now it's in my graveyard which has much more value that's fine like the bolts and the gal blast coming at my creatures huge actually huge actually huge That's fine. Uh, yeah, again, I kind of want to save the Gal Blast. Like, if I need it for creature interaction or if it's going to be one of those uh, just hit him in the face with it type of things. Uh, let's play this out. Let's play the Dross Forge Bridge. Um, and then I can I can sack it to the Reckoner's Bargain because I kind of need to. Kind of Those blood tokens now would, would be very useful just to get rid of these lands here. Be very useful right now. That sucks. Yep. Just hit this. Right. Yep. That's how they're going to play it through. So I'm going to Reckoner's Bargain. One of the lands. I actually should just hit the treasure token, honestly, but... Ooh. Finally, my Acre Wellsprings for my sacks, but I have nothing to sack now. Yo, I need something. I'll tell you what. Like, I, have, I am drawing nothing here. I'm drawing a big sack of lands right now. Drawing a big sack of lands. I got two draws off this, and I kind of kind of just need something here. Yo, be for real. Be for real right now. Five lands in hand is crazy. Especially after everything that I just did. I guess it was inevitable, but come on. We have interacted with them up until this point here. Okay, deadly dispute is something. I'll main phase it. Take the Dross Forge Bridge that just came in topped. Oh, Lord. Okay. Okay, I guess Kenku is something. Yeah, Kenku is something. Target the Dross Forge Bridge. So now we got an indestructible 3-3. Attack. Kenku is something, so. Yeah, 
if they have another journey to nowhere so be it like oh so much okay i feel like we've gone through a big clump i have 24 cards left in my library like all these lands out right like i've been sacking like okay where am i at with my land count honestly one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fourteen out of my fourteen on my lands fourteen on my lands go to my collection where is it popper affinity fourteen of my nineteen lands like yo really yo <laughs> ah! the dawnbringer cleric too They'll probably snipe something out of my yard. Yeah, they don't want the blood fountain being that effective. All right. Um, play that. They got zero cards, so they're they're top decking just like me. Nice little, it, it feels like kind of the Thoughtseize bug, but it's not Thoughtseize. You know what I'm saying? Like they just target the bird Forcer and they're like, let me get rid of it. And then I just drew one, you know, the, just that, just that little bit of, little bit of, a little bit of sauce. So I'm hoping they draw land. I've drawn so many lands, right? I have five more lands in my deck out of 23. So I'm hoping to really draw, just draw gas here. Um, also, I got to keep taking a look back at my list here. So I have one more blood fountain for use. Deadly Disputes, I have none. Reckoner's Bargain, I have one more. Thought Cast. There's not a lot of gas left in my deck, so... I haven't drawn my Gal Blast either, really, so... It sucks. I'm gonna... Whatever I draw, it's gonna be real slow. I use my Deadly Disputes pretty early, but I do have Reckoner's Bargain. I will say that. I do have Reckoner's Bargains. I have one, two, three. I have one more Deadly Dispute. Yeah, this is where things get problematic. That's where things get problematic. Yep. I'll take that. Yep, this is where things become problematic. Why don't you just equip that? That was that was so strange. Makeshift munitions, that's a card. Yeah, makeshift munitions is a magic card. Okay. That is a magic card. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, nine, ten. I have ten damage on board. I have ten damage on board. So I can't, s yeah. I have 10 damage on board. I just have to hope they don't like draw like Helix or something. Okay, do you have another creature? That's fine. You have to have another creature. I don't think you want, yeah, I was gonna say, I don't think you want me like getting free damage. So I need to I need to ping this down. So I'm losing so I'm losing some potential damage here. I'm losing some potential damage here to their face because I need to clear this board. The problem is I need to ping three at this, not two, because this will deal damage to non-flying. Right? Let's draw with it. Nice. I like that. Get the treasure tokens. What am I actually... Oh, no. Yeah, I'm trying to kill this. Yeah. I was like, what am I actually doing when I'm trying to kill that? Thought cast. 
All right, I will take that for what it is. That's pretty sweet. Go Ginger Brew. Ginger Brew gaining me three life is actually pretty sweet too. We're Enforcer. Okay, we're bringing it back. If I can get one attack in. One attack in and we get there. Oh, like one attack with the Mer Enforcer and we kind of get there with the makeshift munitions. They have to see that now too. They have to see that now too. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have ten. I have 10 damage off my lands, right? If I pay one sack, <sighs> okay. Then I have a, I have 11 with a great furnace. Yeah, they'll bring that back in. This is, this is quite the grind fest. If I can draw a galvanic blast here, I win. Cause that creates the differential I need. And they have to leave everything like untapped here, I think. Interesting. They're gonna go. They're gonna go on the offensive. Okay. They're gonna go on the offensive. That makes sense for them. I need to draw a gal blast right now. And I can win. Hmm. Uh, let me let me recognize bargain. Let me recognize bargain one of my lands. Okay, I don't know how far I want to do this right now. Um, recognize bargain one of my lands. Come on. Okay, there you go. Gal blast. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six to ten. I think I just ping down their board, honestly. I think that's that's what I do here. And I just go in for an attack. Let me let me think here. So uh four damage. I get through five. If I uh take one of these. I do have to lose my lands for this, so here, here. I, I have to lose a bunch of my lands for this. And just just kill this right and then hit a black source black and blue source just kill that down and then go go to combat attack it was this is a tight play i'm really hoping they don't draw another like bounce source because i just committed all these resources just to doing all that they are at seven right so i only need to deal like three but this was quite a quite a grindy game just to get like this far. Be for real right now. Okay, yep, destroy target enchantment. That's fine. I don't know how far I want to go with that, so wasn't exactly enthusiastic to sack the last one. Maybe I needed to sack that last one though. Stuff by creatures with haste. Probably just do that. Going for five. Oh, I win here actually. Uh, do I? Well, I going for an attack. Yeah. So make this unblockable. Begin combat. Attack. They have to block the enforcer because they have to suspect a gal blast in my hand, right? Yeah. Yeah. You have to block the enforcer. Yep, you're at six. Like, I'm getting there. I'm getting there, I think. Okay, if they just stop drawing ringers, be for real. <sighs> be for real right now, okay? 
Just give me another, like, be for real right now. Okay. Holy, they are like, they're just drawing zingers and like, okay, there you go. There is something. Blood fountain. Play this. I have to gal blast this, I think. Or do I? Not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Uh, get out. Kenku Artificer, or no, Ginger Brute? Frogmite. Ginger Brute, Frogmite. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Play Frogmite. I can play Ginger Brute next turn. Hold up Gal Blast. Make this unblockable. No, just hold up Gal Blast for now. Because they. Yeah, hold up Gal Blast for now. And then if they do nothing, just, just sack the. I'm playing really carefully right now. I have nine minutes left to play the next one. I've been playing it real slow. Okay. We need to be like be on the offensive offensive. Oh lord. This is so tough right now. Okay. That's great. Be for real right now. Be for real. Be for real. You're bolting me. You going in for an attack? That's dangerous. That's a dangerous. Okay, so GG's. You have zero cards in hand. GG's. Okay, cool. Creature with haste. Yeah, GG's. So I play Ginger Brute. They want me to use on my clock, which is completely fair. Uh, yep. Attack. All right. Oh, this game. I don't think I win this. Like, truly. Um, Blue Elemental Blast is probably one of my best spells right now. Like, truly. Uh, Karklan Shaman is, like, all right. But still. It's not It's not the best. I don't think this is... I don't think Karklan Shaman is how I want to be doing things. Uh, take out probably the Metallic Rebukes. Uh, maybe like, yeah, maybe like one, like the hill spell bombs aren't that useful. Maybe just bring in all four gorilla shamans and just grind out their artifacts because they're going to have them, but it's not like, it's not like to the point where maybe the removal is better, but life gain is going to be big here too. Like, they're creatures. We're going to be fighting a pretty big creature war. And I think maybe I don't want maybe that many Gorilla Shamans. Take out a Reckoner's Bargain. For another Chainers. Just play the removal game. I think we just play the removal game. The Blue Elemental Blasts are going to be big here. Me playing this with like eight minutes left. It's, it's win this match or not, really. But I think we can, I think we can do it. Just have to have a good hand off the start here. This is not a good hand. It's, it's, it's funny though. Uh, I'll keep this. 
drop a silver bluff bridge. It's not a great hand. It could be better, but it draws me cards. It starts things off. That first hand was hilarious. <laughs> that first hand was truly hilarious. Uh, we'll play it safe, right? If they have the Gorilla Shaman, they kept a seven, right? So play out the indestructible lands. Okay. Bring the Icar Wellspring, sure. Uh, probably play this in the Icar Wellspring. Yeah, there you go. That's a way to draw some cards on my side too. Again, just playing it safer on that Gorilla Shaman. Yep. Start playing some threats. Start playing some threats, opponent. Yep. Thrabin Inspector. Thrabin Inspector. All right. Chromatic Star. Pass the turn. Those Helices are going to be pretty annoying to deal with. Uh, I think I... I think I hit that. I think I hit that. Those are the type of things I don't want them like flipping and everything. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, cool. Revoke existence me to death. We'll exchange some resources here. Blue. Podcast. Okay. Just drawing through, trying to have more resources. Probably play Dross Forge Bridge, Blood Fountain. Just have that access. I like that. Just main main phasing the clue. Just not having other things to do is is great here. Right, so play that. Play the blood fountain. Right, and then what I'll do is I'll uh, I'll deadly dispute at end step here. Mm, okay, I'll deadly dispute now. See if 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 I draw like a blue elemental blast, I could counter it here. Okay, no such luck. Okay, that's fine. Keep my artifacts on the battlefield for the um, Reinforcer. Yep. So they probably have like some amount of Gal Blast and stuff, right? On their board. So play that. Actually should have used the black for that. Bit of a bit of a misplay on that side. Play the Icar Wellspring. We can sack that to the Reckoner's Bargain and pass through. Right, we're getting some, we're getting some stuff on the board. Getting some stuff on the board. I'm not, I'm not exactly tied to like attacking that with that right now. But they're using some resources. I think we're gaining a little bit more. Okay. Again, whatever they whatever they target with this, we are yeah we're gonna reckoners bargain that. We're gonna reckoners bargain that. Yep. Gain some life. It's pretty big. And just make those journeys like quote unquote useless, right? Uh, that's the general goal there. I mean, bet, right? More than happy to get rid of a blocker here. What the. I was I was just like free. Why why would you why would you let me do that? Start getting offensive. Go to combat. Attack. Blood fountain. Play out the Mer Enforcer. 
Pass through. I'll sell. I'll save my gal blast. Like if I see anything problem, like super problematic, come down, then that's what the gal blasts are for. But <sighs> yep. Yeah, if that, I'll let them attack with the 2-2. Two -two. If they play no other creature, I will actually just Gal Blast. Uh, I will actually just Gal Blast the 2-2. Two -two. Yeah, I will actually just Gal Blast the 2-2. Two -two. Uh, or that, actually. That works. That is, even, that is much better. Attack. Oh, I messed up. I didn't play the ginger brute. That's that's dumb. I have the ginger brute in hand. That is dumb. That is dumb. That is a point of damage that we're missing out on, which is not great. Okay. And then I think what I'll do here, end step, blood token away the Dross Forge Bridge. Nice. Another one. Four mirrored in. Here, here, draw through, okay. <laughs> exactly enough. Choose it up, right? Just keep creatures off their board. Going for a combat attack. Big thing is, is like, so right now they should be at 17. One point of damage, I feel like might make or break the difference here. But so right now I have 12 damage in hand. If I can draw my last Gal Blast, the big thing I have to be worried about truly is like Helices. Helices is the big thing I got to worry about right now. Right, they're going to gain two life. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. That's fine. That's good. I'm, I'm happy I used the Chainer's Edict in my graveyard. That's good. I I was playing around like a potential Relic of Progenitus coming down. So that's good. That was a good call on my part there. Chainer's. Attack. Like what, what I'm doing by, by using up all these chainers and everything, I understand that I could have like, I could just make these unblockable. Essentially, I'm just like giving them like, like a mental clock in the sense that like, hey, I have all this removal. I have all this stuff. You have to expend resources and draw things to deal with it. Like you have to, you have to do that. And at some point, I have to, like, okay. Yeah, I was going to say, at some point, I just have to ho hope they draw dead. But if they're going to draw cards like that, then all right. Interesting. They actually went for the Icker Wellspring, not the... Yeah, okay. They actually went for the Icker Wellspring. That is interesting. Make you sack. Attack. Cause I don't want that. I don't want that coming back as a three one, right? The clock is mine. That's, that's essentially what I want to show them. The clock is mine. They might also be trying to draw some life gain too, right? Cause they've recognized that I have not played a single land and I've had roughly three to four cards in my hand that I have not cast over and over again. So they have to expect that some number of them are gal blasts. They're smart. They have to expect that. So I, I, I have the opportunity here. Again, they are drawing a little dead, a little. So I just have to hope this continues. Yeah. Deadly Dispute is actually fantastic. Attack. Yo, Ginger Brutes for the win, eh? Like, again, they, sh they, really, they really should be at like 13 right now but we'll see 
They really should be at 13 right now. Synthesizer, okay. I like this. I want I want them to use up. I want them to use up here. Yep. Okay, love that. Love that. Love that. Okay, so I'm going to Deadly Dispute here. Hit the Icker Wellspring, draw three cards. Nice. I'm going to keep drawing. Hit one of these treasure tokens. Not like the end of the world, but like essentially if I can. Yeah, the idea here is if I can draw into. If I can draw into my last gal blast, there it is. OK. All right. GG's opponent. GG's. OK, so I will just go in for the pure line here. Make this unblockable. Make this unblockable as well. Right, just play this right. I actually should have just tapped this. Uh, blue elemental blast. That. With this. Right. Attack. Yeah, and GG's. All right, we we got there. We got there again. Just just. <laughs> Affinity doing affinity things. Okay. All right. All right. Gal blast you. One, two, <laughs> three. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. All right. Wow. All right. All that effort. We got there. Let's get it. Let's get it.